right, so this is the Range Rover Sport HSE. Doing the wheel bearing and rotor. Brake pads. All right, so first thing we do is use the little grease. Greased up inside our shaft there. Greased inside the shaft. We put our bolts in the back. Both sides. Hub, it can only run out one way. Short, smaller end to the top. Larger end to the bottom. So we're gonna put our hub in now. Slide it onto our axle spline. We got our hub onto our axle spline. We started all four of our number 15s. Now we're going to go around the back, go around clockwise, and pull the hub in with the bolts. All right, so I've tightened all four number 15s, which pulled our hub all the way in. Now we're going to tighten our axle nut right all the way down as far as you can. It's uh, 32 millimeter. Alright, so you just want to reinstall your ABS sensor and that's a number 8. Now we're going to put back on our new rotor. It's a T50. Bolts it to our hub. You just want to line up your bolt hole in your rotor and install your T50. Alright, rotor's installed. Now you're going to put back on your retainer. Two 21 12 points. 21. 12 point. Tighten those down. Alright, 21's are installed and tightened. Next, we're going to install your brake pads into your retainer. Alright, so you want to reinstall your caliper. Put back in your two number 13s. And also your brake wear sensor. Now we're going to install our tire. With the center hub out so we can tighten our axle nut. Alright, once you reinstall your rim, put your center cap out. Want to tighten inside there and also tap the lock. A small slot there where you want to tap it, the nut in. So 22 millimeter lug nuts, 32 millimeter axle nut, and tap the wheel. And that's the Range Rover Sport front wheel bearing replacement. Thanks for watching. Subscribe, comment, hit that like button. See you next time.